How to Make an Apple Pie and See the World by Marjorie Priceman. Making an apple pie is really very easy. First, get all the ingredients at the market. Mix them well, bake, and serve. Unless, of course, the market is closed. In that case, go home and pack a suitcase. Take your shopping list and some walking shoes. Then catch a steamship bound for Europe. Use the six days on board to brush up on your Italian. If you time it right, you'll arrive in Italy at harvest time. Find a farm deep in the countryside. Gather some superb Simonia wheat. An armful or two will do. Then hop a train to France and locate a chicken. French chickens lay elegant eggs, and you want only the finest ingredients for your pie. Coax the chicken to give you an egg. Better yet, bring the chicken with you. There's less chance of breaking the egg that way. Get to Sri Lanka any way you can. You can't miss it. Sri Lanka is a pear-shaped island in the Indian Ocean. The best cinnamon in the world is made there, from the bark of the native karundu tree. So go directly to the rainforest, find a karundu tree, and peel off some bark. If a leopard is napping beneath the tree, be very quiet. Hitch a ride to England. Make the acquaintance of a cow. You'll know she's an English cow from her good manners and charming accent. If you can borrow a cup or two of milk, even better, bring the whole cow with you for the freshest possible results. Stow away on a banana boat headed home to Jamaica. On your way there, you can pick up some salt. Fill a jar with salty seawater. When the boat docks in Jamaica, walk to the nearest sugar plantation. Introduce yourself to everyone. Tell them about the pie you're making. Then go into the fields and cut a few stalks of sugar cane. Better fly home. You don't want the ingredients to spoil. Wait a minute. Aren't you forgetting something? What about the apples? Have the pilot drop you off in Vermont. You won't have to go far to find an apple orchard. Pick eight rosy apples from the top of the tree. Give one to the chicken, one to the cow, and eat one yourself. That leaves five for the pie. Then hurry home. Now, all you have to do is mill the wheat into flour, grind the karundu bark into cinnamon, evaporate the seawater from the salt, boil the sugar cane, persuade the chicken to lay an egg, milk the cow, churn the milk into butter, slice the apples, mix the ingredients, and bake the pie. While the pie is cooling, invite some friends over to share it with you. Remember, that apple pie is delicious topped with vanilla ice cream, which you can get at the market. But if the market happens to be closed, you can eat it plain.